Hey everyone, this is Adam and today I'm going to be showing you a quick tutorial on how to compress and downsize large PDF presentation exports from Figma using the Pitch Deck plugin. So to get started, if you just jump into your Figma file, click on the little resources icon up here, and if you just search for Pitch Deck, so that's P-I-T-C-H-D-E-C-K, you can run the plugin by clicking on the Pitch Deck item under the Plugins tab, and then just click on this Run button here, or you can click on this little save icon here, which I'd recommend, and that will save it to your plugins list for easy access later. So I've already clicked on the save icon, so I'm just gonna to go to my canvas, I'm just gonna right click anywhere and go down to plugins, then go down to saved plugins and click on the pitch deck item. And that's just gonna run the plugin we saved a second ago. So if you're new to the plugin, the way that it works is it basically allows you to load in frames and components and instances from your Figma page as slides, and then you can export those slides to various formats like PowerPoint, uh, web presentations, and PDF files. So today I'm gonna to be focusing on PDF files, specifically for large presentations that contain uh, very high resolution image assets. So you can see here, I've got a couple of assets that I've downloaded from Unsplash, and you can see the size of them uh, max out at the 4,000 pixel size limit for Figma. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you what this looks like when I apply uh, those kind of high resolution fills to our image frames. So I'm just gonna drag and drop those images into here, just swap out these image frames that I've already kind of got added in. And I'm gonna do a really quick export without the downsizing feature, and then I'm gonna show you it with the downsizing feature to compare the difference. So if we were to just to export this from Figma itself, so if you go to File and then click on Export Frames to PDF, this will give you a PDF file uh, native exported from Figma. So if I click Save on that one, and then open up the file information on that one, so I'm just gonna click Get Info, and see what that looks like. So we can see that the exported PDF from Figma is about 20 megabytes. So that's fairly large for a deck with nine slides in it. So I'm just gonna close that off. So now that we've kind of got a baseline for exporting the PDF uh, from Figma and seeing it's about 20 megabytes, what we can do is now go to the export feature in the plugin by clicking on this export button in the top right hand side, clicking on that. And by default, it will select the pitch deck presentation upload option. So that's the default, but we're actually gonna click on that option and we're gonna skip the PowerPoint, Keynote, and Google Slides option and just go all the way down to PDF. And for PDF quality, I'm just gonna leave that at 300 DPI, which is the maximum best quality for now. You can reduce that if you wanna get even further compression uh, for DPI, so you can set it to 150 for screens. 72 is gonna look a bit average, so I'd probably just leave it at 300 and you'll get the best quality. And I'm just gonna do another baseline test without the downsize option enabled. So I'm gonna go through that in a second but just exporting this to PDF uh, with the regular export from uh, the Pitch Deck plugin. This is gonna optimize the PDF as you can see. So if I save that to my desktop. So I'm just gonna click on the Get Info for that option as well. And if we open that up, we can see here that the compressed version is about 5.6 megabytes, uh, but we can actually get it even smaller than that. So I'll show you how to do that now. So if you go back to your export settings, just click on the export button one more time. And this time we're gonna enable a new feature called Downsize Large Figma Image Fills. So to explain what this option does, as you can see here, you've got these really big 4,000 pixel image fills or images that have been added to these layers over here. So these layers are only 700 by 700 pixels, but the underlying image fill is much greater. So the underlying image fill is about 4,000 pixels. So what that means is that full resolution image is still being loaded into the Figma frame here and still being exported to your PDF files. But because all of that extra size doesn't really matter for a smaller layer, what this little toggle here will do is it'll go through any image fills in your slides and it will check if the image is greater than two times the size of the layer itself. And then it will automatically downsize that to a 2X resolution. So this is gonna save us a lot of image data. So if we enable the downsize large image fills option and then re-export that to PDF, so I'm just gonna click on export to PDF. And once that finishes up in a moment, you can see here it's downsizing the image fills. So it's checking them and it found that these two are gonna be much larger. So it just downsized those. You can't tell the difference in quality. Uh, it's still retina. And now if we download our PDF file one last time, so I'm gonna click on download your PDF file, save that to my desktop, so now that we've saved that to our desktop, once again, we can click on that file, get the info of that. And if we open that up, you can see that that's now been shrunk down to 1.8 megabytes. So we've gone from 20 megabytes with the native Figma export to about five megabytes 
with the PDF export from Pitch Deck without the downsize feature enabled. And then we've now shrunk that down uh, more than half again to 1.8 megabytes with the downsize toggle enabled. So that downsize toggle really makes a difference if you've got a lot of slides or even just a few slides with really large high resolution image fields that have been used originally. Uh, you don't need all of that image data behind the scenes when the layers are much, much smaller. So this feature will automatically go through and do that. Uh, and it's worth noting that this will only need to be done the first time around. So if we were to rerun this now, it's not going to try and re-downsize those images because they've already been downsized. So it'll skip over those, um, which means that the first export with this toggle enabled is always going to be a little bit slower. But every subsequent rerun, uh, this is worth just keeping enabled. So if you've added any new images uh, that are larger, it'll just check those out before it exports the PDF. So you're ensuring that you're always getting the lowest size possible uh, with that toggle enabled. So that's basically it. I just wanted to show you this quick tutorial uh, with that new downsize toggle, uh, which is gonna help you to shrink or compress all of these really large Figma exports uh, when you are exporting your slides to a PDF file uh, using the Pitch Deck plugin with this uh, downsize feature. And as I mentioned as well, you can play around with the DPI in combination with that. So if you were to set that to 150 DPI, uh, that file size would shrink down even further. So that's probably a pretty good compromise if you wanna uh, play around with those settings too. So yeah, thank you as always for watching. I hope that's been helpful for compressing your PDF exports and we'll be back soon with more Figma tutorials like this one in the weeks and months ahead.